Here I will show you how to place the outdoor condenser unit and, right, and run the refrigerant pipe to the indoor unit which is this type, type pine pole unit. Let's go to mechanical. Here we have already inserted the mechanical family which is this outdoor condenser unit. We have to place it here. Now we're going to present this by placing a line here. If you look at it in 3D, we're going to run a line, a pipe on the side and goes down to the floor below. So let's represent this with a pipe which is about 50 mm or 75 mm diameter because the and let's set the height as 5200 or 200 mm for the floor level. Because our reference now is currently at level 1, so we have to refer to level 2. Then it will be 200 above the floor level. We're going to select the mid point of this unit. Then we're going to select the point where we're going to drop down the pipe. Typically, we'll pull it beside the. It's too short, so let's. Standard pipe. Here's the pipe. Asking for an attribute. So you cannot connect here because the pipe size and diameter are different. We have faced some issues once we connect the pipe here, so let's diagrammatically show the pipes here. So it's just for reference. Once we click here, it's automatically connecting to the pipe connection, so we cannot connect it. We just place it as close to it as possible. Then make an elbow, and here we're going to drop down to the floor. Here. Then let's change the elevation to a negative. Uh, we have three three out of five. That's so negative one seven. We apply. Until this symbol appears, it means that the pipe will drop down to the floor. Here we can also look at it in 3D. We have set the pipe from here and it goes down to the floor below. You can see it also on the wire And it's going to drop down and connect to this pipe. So basically the refrigerant pipe will be grouped together. Uh, one gas and one uh, liquid line and the wiring from the outdoor unit to the condenser unit. So basically the whole pipe size is about 75 mm including the insulation. So let's go down to level 1. Here we cannot see the pipe. So we have to create a section and look and search for the pipe where it has dropped down and what elevation. Here we can see that the pipe is somewhere here. We can take this as well. So, and then we can show the, the shade of traffic. We cannot see the pipe, unfortunately, it's because of this guy. It's right on the edge, so we have to set this here. Let's set the pipe at 3 4. Let's use standard pipe. We just use this standard pipe as our representation. Let's connect from here. Let's set it as 3 4. And apply and then click it. And we're just going to select here. And the same for this little bit. Let's select the system under the pipe and Let's set it at 3 4. Let's not connect to the unit. We're just using it as representation. Then let's go here. And let's try to connect to the refrigerant pipe. So let's get set it closer to the refrigerant pipe. We can do an alignment. 
can align this part or we can align this part with the center of part or we can just actually move it anyway uh, this one we need to, uh, to erase this uh, then uh, let's go to this section except this one is the end is about negative one seven so here is three four so negative one six it should be at the same line now but at a different position so let's just connect on this pipe let's use the system pipe and set up three four let's go to the center and Connect to here and connect to the pipe. Alright, we should we can connect this two pipe by delay. And now we can go to 2 and see the connections of the pipe. This is the let's go to shaded and uh, let's go to mechanical so we can still see here. Here is the piping and the upper condensing unit and refrigerant pipe connection to the uh, for them, uh, to the indoor pump this is pipe is a 75 mm pipe it's a representation of pipes grouped together which is the gas and liquid line including the wirings from wire wiring power wiring for the outdoor condensing and to the indoor condensing so that is what it is the outdoor condensing unit with the refrigerant pipe You can also place it with the consistent color. This is a simple representation. Typically, the refrigerant piping, we, especially single units, we don't go to uh, individual pipes. We only have to group. We group them together into one pipes, or I mean, not one pipe, one set of pipes with an insulation. So this is how to represent the refrigerant piping system. In Revit for outdoor and indoor.